up YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Zaki. I am back, you guys, with another one. If you are new to the channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. I hope you really, really love it here. Thank you so much for choosing to subscribe and choosing to click on this video. So the first thing that has helped me reset in 2024 is asking the hard questions. I had to go back to the year before, to 2023, and ask the hard questions. Why wasn't that area of my life fruitful? Why was I crippled in that area? And what are the things that are no longer working? When I looked back at 2023, I really, really felt like I was just surviving through the year. But I wasn't actually living. I felt as though life was just happening to me throughout 2023. And because I had not set goals, like measurable goals in 2023, it was really hard for me to measure. Uguti, have I made progress? Was I able to achieve these things that I wanted to achieve in the different spheres of my life? I found that so, so difficult. You know, everything was just surface level, but I didn't really go into the nitty gritties. And so what I've decided to do Kulonyaga is take it month by month. I know some people do it like quarterly, but I've decided to just take it month by month. So in each month, have a set of goals that I have for the different spheres of my life. And then at the end of, at the end of that month, I measure Uguti, have I met my goals for that month? I realized for Tuguti, the year is long and it can be so overwhelming to just, you know, plan for an entire year. But if you just take it month by month, bit by bit, you are able to just plan for the month and then at the end of that month, assess Tuguti, have you met your goals? And if you haven't met your goals, why haven't you met your goals? The second thing that has helped me to reset in 2024 is making small changes. I realized, Uguti, you know, sometimes you, you set these big goals. Okay, I want to change this. I want to start doing this and I want to start doing that. These huge changes that really, 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 you are just going to shock your entire life. So what's been helping me is just making small changes. Like just small tweaks, you know, I'll give you an example, one that has been just, that has changed my life tremendously. So just waking up earlier, guys, that thing has changed my life. I really, really struggled with this thing. Life was just coming at me. I'd wake up, by the time I'm done with work, I am done. I've got nothing left to give. And this was um, inspired by um, a very good friend of mine, Ufulu. Um, Ufulu wakes up at 3 a.m. Guys, she has this thing where she wakes up at 3 a.m. I realized, Uti, when I woke up earlier, my day just felt longer. Apart from Umsebenz, I'd be able to do all the things that I want to do. Just a small change has just shifted my life you know and that's the one thing that i'm focused on jenga manj there are other things that i want to do this year i want to start like a, a fitness journey glow up, you know so that is on pause until i've built momentum on this thing of waking up early and i will focus on that until i've built momentum and i've built the confidence it's okay this thing is solid this is now a part of my routine it no longer feels strange to me the third thing that has helped me reset in 2024 is showing myself grace right what does this mean this means i don't give up i don't give up on myself let's say namsanje you plan to it's okay Today is Monday, I'm going to do one, two, and three. Let's say you are unable now to do, to get to these three things. You are only able to just do the one thing. Don't give up. Don't give up. On Tuesday, get up again and go for the three things that you wanted to do. Because sometimes we get discouraged, Ugo team. 
yo, Osiam, you know, yo, I didn't meet my goals, yo, I, I planned to do this and then I didn't do it. And then we give up, we throw, so I mean, throw the baby with the bath water, throw the bath water with the baby. No, don't give up on yourself, keep pushing until you have that thing established. And then the fourth thing that's helped me to reset in 2024 has been prioritizing my relationship with God. I shared in the previous video that I did that this scripture has been in my heart, Leneliti, the people who know their God shall be strong and shall do great exploits. And I realized with no man, the enemy bullied me last year because of my ignorance. There are things that I didn't know about God. And I explained in that video, Ukuti, you, you know it, but you haven't caught it. So you don't really know it. Yeah, but it's just, but it hasn't, your spirit hasn't caught on to it. And so that is my goal for this year, to know him. Ogunye can wait. The other things, guys, really, they can wait. But let's start here. Let's know him. Let everything else flow from the revelation of him. So yeah, my beauties, those are the four things that have helped me to reset in 2024. I hope you, you, you picked up something from this video. Please do share um, some of the things that have helped you reset in the comments down below. Yeah, I look forward to, to, to reading your comments. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, my beauties, for taking the time to watch this video. Um, yeah, I hope it was helpful. I will see you guys on the next one. Blessings.